Hello, this is Galactic's Tutorials, and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a banner for your Planet Minecraft server. Uh, so what you're going to need, you're going to need a uh, free software, it's called GIMP, the link will be in the description. Uh, you're going to need a uh, few pictures, they could be from your server, but it doesn't really matter. Select all the pictures that you want in your um, banner. So, in order to actually create your um, banner, you're going to have to um, cut out all of the uh, foreground images. So, uh, as you can see, I cut them all out. Um, this is what it looks like not cut out. Uh, this is the final result, so let, let me just show you that. This is what I made. This is the final product. It's 24 7, 150 slots, Skyblock, Multi World, Hunger Games, Screw No Grief, Galactic Craft. Now, the IP for that server will be out uh, as soon as possible, but it's still in progress. Mm. Okay, so let's just select a foreground image to uh, edit. Uh, well, this already came edited. So let's do the diamond. Now, in order to uh, actually like cut it out, you have to right-click it. Oh, let me just let me just drag it over here. You're gonna right-click it. Um, well, this already has an alpha channel, but do add alpha channel. Then use your uh, select tool. Increase the magnification to 400 or 800. I just do this because it makes it much easier to edit it. And, um, edit. Okay, so once you have um, the uh, selecting done, just right click it, go on select, do invert, now right click it again, do edit, and then, oh wait no, edit, sorry, clear. Now, it should be like this, this is the uh, background color, and this is your foreground image. So, this, this, uh, this weird kind of plaid thing, just means that there's no color behind this like there's no image it's not even white so that's good so just save it uh, now do save as and then do diamond.xcf like that now I already have it so I don't have to do that now now just do that for all of your foreground images. It may take some time, but it's what you have to do. So now to actually like make, like add the foreground images to the background. So take your background image, open it as a layer, again, add an alpha channel. You always want to do that. Um, now, you don't want it this big because the uh, requirements for making a banner on Planet Minecraft are 468 pixels by 60 pixels. So, in order to uh, shrink this, you're going to want to take your uh, rectangle tool right over here. Ah, sorry, my mouse is being annoying. Right over here. And then you're just going to want to select the entire image. Now, in order to like shrink it or scale it, go under image, well, right click, go under image, and then do scale image. Click this. Now, you do not want to put under the height as 60 pixels. You, do, you just don't type in 60 pixels at all. Go under the width and type in 468 pixels. Now, it doesn't ma really matter what the height is because we'll get to that in a sec. So it shrunk that. Uh, not too significantly, but to the size that we want it to be. Now, in, now since this is obviously like 
longer than um, 60 pixels. It's like, what, 100 and... What is this? Yeah, 151. You can see it is right over there. Yeah, see? So, we want it, obviously, a lot smaller. So, go right to the corner of your image. And then, go to the edge. And then, you see on the bottom of the screen how it says 468 by 63? Yeah, we'll just do it so it says 468 by 60. Now this is the background to your Minecraft banner. I mean you can move it up and down but this is basically what it's going to be. So select where you want it. I guess I chose, um, I think I chose this because it had nice dark images, lots of detail. Uh, but I'm going to choose this because um, you could probably use black text and red text would show up very nicely in this blue background. So I'm going to select this part of it. So do, again, do uh, select, invert, edit, clear. So now this is definitely your background. So now you want to put in your foreground images, I'm guessing. So just uh, do File, open as layer. Uh, say you want an apple, I guess. Um, now you don't want the apple here. So click on the uh, Select or Move tool and just move the apple to wherever you want it. I want it in the uh, top left of the screen and uh, just to be symmetrical I'm going to make it make another apple in the uh, top right. Now, say your foreground now you could if your foreground image is a little too big for your liking, you can just um close this. I mean, you could save it first, but you could close this and then just um, open as layer with your foreground image. Uh, add an alpha channel. And then you can do the same thing, like scale it, like I did with um, this. So now we have two apples here. That's nice. Uh, we could uh, have uh, something else, I guess. Let's put a um, put a diamond in the middle, I think. Yeah, let's put a diamond right here. Now that looks quite nice, I think. And then, yeah. Okay, so that's a uh, diamond in the middle. Maybe raise it slightly. And then now what you want is you want to have some text. So just click the uh, text button and um, just left click and drag. And that's your little text box. I mean, you can expand it if you want to. But here it is. So uh, I'm just going to make it red because that's a simple color to use. And then bold it if you want. You could change the font. Like you can make it Arial or whatever, Times New Roman, doesn't really matter. Um, but here is what you can do. You can put like Hunger Games. Oh, wait, sorry. I, I forgot to mention that you need to select it in order to change it. So just do that. You can bold it if you want because it might be hurting your viewer's eyes. Maybe. You could switch the font. I'm gonna use. Nah, that doesn't look that good. I'm gonna use. Um, I'm gonna use. Uh, Arial Black. That gives it a nice definitive color. And then I guess we could just make like uh, something over here that has like PVP or something. I don't know. I personally don't make, P I don't really make PVP servers because they're quite hectic. Even though they are easier to manage, uh, I just don't make them. Unless, of course, it's like a multi world server, then I guess I'll have. Uh, uh, PvP thing, but yeah, since it's a Hunger Games, you kind of need PvP in it. Let's just do that, and then uh, highlight it, make it 
red, oh, I guess this type of red, um, bolded, make it the same type of font as before, and, um, and what you want is either your IP address or your server name, you can do either, it doesn't matter, um, say uh, MC Hunger Games, not quite sure if that's a real server or not, but whatever. I personally just like making it a different color than um, the other words, because I guess it's just more important. Uh, let's make it yeah, this color. I kind of, oh, I, I just got an email, sorry for that. Um, I think that's like diamond color. So let's use that. Oh wait, no, that's like the color of the clouds. Let's make it a uh, dark blue. I wonder if that will work. Bold it. Ariel. Um, hopefully this will work. I'm not quite sure. Did it work? Oh uh, yeah, it does. Let me just tweak it slightly like that. And then drag it a bit over here. Perfect. So, um, I guess that's what it looks like. I mean, we could add a little sword here, I guess. Mm. But other than that, it looks quite nice. So, yeah, that's how you make a uh, banner for free. Uh, Planet Minecraft banner for free. Now, in order to save it, save it, I guess. Um, no, I already, I already created this. So, so in order to uh, actually like post it on Planet Minecraft, you can't have it as a uh, .xcf. So just export it. Export it not as a JPEG, but as a PNG. So save it as a uh, uh, MC Hunger Games. Dot PNG. I like saving it as a PNG, but you could save it as anything. I mean, PNG just makes it a lot easier for you if you want to uh, have the uh, background is like nothing. Well, no. If you want to, if you want to leave this as nothing, so just export it. Export. X out. I don't have to save it, so you could save it if you want to, but I'm not. And then, uh, I believe I saved it to my downloads, so... Mm, where did I save it to? Oh no, I saved it to my desktop. Here it is. And that's what it looks like. And then you could go on Planet Minecraft and just upload it. So, uh, that's my tutorial.